How is it going, everybody? You're watching Then About Tech, and today we're going to talk about this. Where can I find a cab? Onde posso encontrar um taxi? That's right. Today we're going to talk about the new live translation feature on your AirPods. Guys, this is absolutely incredible. In this video, I'm going to show you the complete process. So first, how to set it up, how to get it going and working, and also, of course, I'm going to demonstrate in action. So I'm going to speak the language, it's going to translate, another person is going to speak back, and then I'm going to show you the whole process. I'm going to show you in action. Let's get started. Okay, guys, so first things first, there are actually a few criteria you have to meet in order to use the feature, starting with the AirPods themselves, because there are only three compatible models at this moment. So you either have to have an AirPods 4, so normal AirPods, fourth generation, but the ANC model, so specifically this model, or AirPods Pro 2, which is this case right here, or of course, the new AirPods Pro 3. So you gotta have one of those devices. On top of that, you have to have at least an iPhone 15 Pro. So 15 Pro or 15 Pro Max, and of course, the entire 16 series or the entire 17 series. And that's because of Apple intelligence, because those are the compatible devices with Apple intelligence. So you need to have one of those devices and you need to have Apple intelligence enabled, working, and turned on. This is important as well. On top of that, you need to be running at least iOS 26.0, so any version of iOS 26 or newer. And last but not least, your AirPods need to be updated to the latest firmware, but you don't have to worry about that too much because they do that automatically. All you have to do really is plug in your AirPods, so charge your AirPods when they are close to your iPhone and then they will be updated automatically. And then you also need to have the Translate app, which is a native Apple application and you gotta make sure you have it on your phone. I'm gonna show you all that in action right now. So the first thing you have to do really is go ahead, grab your AirPods and then put them in your ears. That's the first thing you have to do. And then the process will get going. And then of course, you're gonna need to go ahead and open up your iPhone settings. And then just make sure to scroll down and let's talk about Apple intelligence. You gotta make sure it's like that, enabled. It needs to have the toggle on, just like you're seeing right here. So it needs to be on the same language as your phone. So your phone language and the language of Apple intelligence, they need to be the same. Otherwise it won't work. It gotta be like that, as you can see, or your own language. So turn it on, as you can see, let's come back. Now let's go all the way up and go to the AirPods menu and then scroll down, keep scrolling, keep scrolling, keep scrolling until you get your translation beta. That's the feature. Yes, the feature is still on a beta, even though iOS 26 isn't anymore, but the feature is, but no problem, because it works pretty much perfectly already. So go ahead and tap on languages, as you can see, and right here you get the supported languages. So English UK, English US, French, German, Portuguese from Brazil, which is my case, and Spanish from Spain. So in this video, we're gonna do it English, to Portuguese, all right? So let's go ahead and download both languages you're gonna use in action. So the language you're gonna say and the language the other person will say. Of course, you can download everything if you want to, but at least the ones you're gonna actually use. So in my case, in my case, Portuguese, Brazil, and then English, US. And this happens sometimes, it's still on a beta, so sometimes you tap on it and it doesn't download. No problem, you can go ahead and then close the settings app, okay, and then reopen it. And then of course, go to your AirPods menu once again, scroll down, go to languages under translation, and then English US. So then, as you can see, got it. So both languages are downloaded. If it's the very first time you're doing this, maybe it will take a while to download, okay? So it's around 500 megabytes each language, but it's not a big deal, all right? So as soon as you have it like that, we're pretty much good to go, because now you're gonna need to open up the Translate app as you're seeing right here. So you can simply go ahead and pull down on your home screen and then look for Translate, that's Spotlight Search. So just Translate and then open it up. If you don't see this application when searching, it's probably because you have deleted the application and you don't remember, but no problem at all. All you have to do is open up the App Store 
and then go to search as you can see and then just search for translate and then you're gonna see this app right here download it of course it's completely free it's a native apple application so let's open it up and then by default it's gonna show you this page but we don't want that we want this one the airpods live so tap on it and then we're good to go it's already going to show us the languages we have previously downloaded and then you're going to choose exactly how you're going to do this which one is your language and which one is the other person's language in my case my language in this example is going to be english and the other person is going to be portuguese now that we are all set let me just explain you how it actually works in action so when you have the feature working so pressing on both sides and active and working your airpods are going to be listening to you so they, they know it's you because of the proximity, okay? So they're gonna be listening to you, and at the same time, they're gonna be listening to the other person, which is external, right? And it's gonna actually pick up and translate both at the same time, and display on the phone both at the same time, and of course, you'll be able to play as an audio or just read as the text. And of course, I'm gonna show you all that. So in order to make this work in this video, I decided to make it a very simple thing. So I'm gonna speak in English, and then I'm gonna have my computer right here pretending to be the other person. So I'm gonna be using English, the other person, my computer, which is a recording of myself, uh, is gonna be speaking in Portuguese, pretending I'm traveling to Brazil, for example, all right? So let's go ahead and get started. Let me see if I can get it in one go and, and, and like choreograph all that, but let's go ahead and begin. So you can enable the feature by pressing both stems at the same time for like two seconds, pressing and holding, or by tapping here on this button. So let's begin. Where can I find a taxi nearby? Onde posso encontrar um taxi por perto? Fica logo ali, ao lado do ponto de ônibus na sua primeira esquerda. So, as you can see, it picked up perfectly. It picked up my question, the other person's answer, and let me just close that because it's gonna be constantly picking up, as you can see. And the coolest thing about the process is, as I said, it's gonna display everything on the phone so everyone can easily see and read, but it also has audio. So I can tap on the play button so the other person can hear it if for some reason they can't read it, for example. So you can play and they can listen. And of course, when the other person speaks to you, your AirPods are gonna be playing that sound translated for you. So it's incredible the way it works. So you're talking to a person, they're saying whatever they're saying, their language, and you're listening pretty much real time. It takes like two seconds and you're listening in your own language. So it's audio and it's text, real time, amazing. So let me just give you another example. So let's go ahead with another one. And again, I can enable the feature right here or right there. This time I'm gonna go with the button. So let's go ahead and begin. How much is this product? Quanto custa este produto? Custa R$ 75,25 e você pode pagar com cartão de crédito. Perfect. So um, it just got exactly, perfectly what I was saying, right? Because it's, it's a recording of myself, but what the other person is saying, like real time. And as you're seeing right here, as it is translating, I'm listening. So again, it takes like two seconds and it is real time. So that's pretty much how you can use and a live demonstration of this feature, which is, in my opinion, one of the coolest of iOS 26 and not everyone is really talking about it and not everyone is actually showing step by step in detail how it actually works and how you can use it right now on your devices. So hopefully you enjoyed this video. Hopefully it was helpful to you. That's always my goal here on Danabal Tech. So see you later on the next one guys. Bye bye.